so today we're going on a camel safari where we're gonna ride camels and drive through the desert and then sleep under the stars in the desert. So we're just waiting for the tour company to come pick us up. And uh, it's kind of hard because A, there's really no addresses here in Dubai, so when you tell them the name of a tower, you have to tell them, or where you're, when you tell them the like, name of where you're staying, you have to tell them, like, oh, it's across from the Dubai mall near this, blah, blah, blah. Um, and also, there's no number that they can contact us at if they're lost. So we're just kind of sitting outside, hoping that they find us. Oh my god, Phil would love this. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> I was like, why are there oh shit bars in here? Why are there so many of them? Oh, now I get it. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Is this normal? <laughs> yeah. More than normal. I was gonna More say, normal. this is what we signed up for. I didn't know. <laughs> you, I, you signed up for this. I don't know. Yeah, I just brought you along. You're just so long for the ride. <laughs> Clear, clearly. We don't need to go to any amusement park. This. There's no roller coaster that's quite this cool. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> We're gonna go ride some camels. Let's go slide up. Like right by us, babe. Backseat, backseat. Backseat. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh, that wasn't so hard. <laughs> Hi. Oh. Can I? Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're so cute. I think it's gonna be scary when we stand up. Probably. Did not realize how tall, how high up we were gonna be. Just so you can get an idea, that's the ground. This one just let out a mask. The one in front of you? Yeah. I can't smell it yet though. With every step, this one keeps farting more and more and more. These would be fun to race. <laughs> We're not raising these things. <laughs> you don't feel that confident yet? I feel comfortable driving a car, Lindsay. That doesn't mean I want to drive for NASCAR. <laughs> don't you start trotting on me. <laughs> He's like, I want to keep up. <gasps> okay. My thighs are going to hurt so bad later. I'm like holding on for dear life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Someone's pooping. Oh. Mine? I don't know. Oh. Gotta give our guide props because I can't even walk on the beach with no shoes. Okay, me and my camel are not getting along. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh boy. I think, I think sitting down was actually scarier than standing up. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually really fun, but it hurts your crotch area a little bit. And Karina's camel doesn't want to cooperate, cooperate really. <laughs> or behave. Your daughter just really likes me. I'm not sure which one. Wow, that's a little steep. Oh, yeah, this is kind of the scary part because my camel wants to keep. Standing, um, next to me. standing next to Lindsay, and it's not a two-way street. It's more of a one-lane. Oh, that's really cool. So you can also pick to do this, but uh. All right, so Lindsay, how's that? <laughs> oh my God, it hurts so bad. <laughs> so we came back. All these people are here, so we're gonna have dinner with them. I don't know how many of them are actually staying overnight with us, but we'll see. But uh, that was really fun, and but I would never do it for more than an hour. When I was in Morocco, we were supposed to do it for six hours. There's no way. There's no way I could have done that. But it was awesome. Okay, we're gonna scale this hill. Are you ready? Back on with a backpack. All right. Oh boy. The uh, decision to wear tennis shoes that have a mesh opening in the front was very stupid. This is my workout. Oh. <laughs> you did not get past. We made it. Camels are cheating on us. So right now everyone's just relaxing and we're getting ready to eat and I think there's gonna be like a ballet dancing show or something. You can go get henna, you can go smoke shisha, you can drink wine like we're doing. 
Um, it's just really cool. I'm not sure what we're gonna eat. Um, <laughs> meat or chicken? Meat or chicken. One thing we've noticed here is that when we go to like a traditional place, they either have meat or chicken. And they never tell us what the meat is. So we're just, we don't know. We don't know what it is. We ate it once and it was not very good. So we're, we're sticking with chicken. The show is starting. I don't know what it is. We'll see. Stampede for dinner. So we just went to go get some food at the buffet. And uh, if you don't like your food touching other food, uh, I don't recommend it. <laughs> There's... No calls out. No call out. Uh, on that one. Yeah, no. Green Associates in hyperdrive right now. Yeah. But it's just food upon food upon food, and I'm so excited. It looks so good. Fantastic. Yeah, I bet it's really good. Like, we're the only ones planning on staying the night here. So we're starting to wonder if we're crazy. I don't know if there's anything we can do. I mean, if we really wanted to go back, they'd probably have someone come get us, but I don't know. This is really... it'll be fun. Let's okay. go on an adventure. <laughs> we're totally on an adventure. So we're staying. We, we gotta stay. <laughs> and we're smoking shisha, not hashish. Not hashish. <laughs> shisha. Or hookah. Oh, we can right. ask them if they have flavors. <laughs> we gotta finish. I don't even know how this works. Yeah, I don't. Whenever I do it, I don't feel like I'm doing it right. <laughs> I just feel like I'm like inhaling flavor. Well, I guess that's what it is. <laughs> oh god. I don't feel high. <laughs> Look what's happening over there. Oh gosh. So we're about to go to bed. And then they come over and he says, skin skiing? <laughs> he must know how good we are at skiing. Oh gosh. <gasps> oh my god, it's actually like snowboard. Yeah, I gotta put my shoes on. Well, I guess we're gonna do it. <laughs> Why not? Like real sandboards. Real snowboards. <laughs> oh my god, how do I stop? I don't really realize when I got myself. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> so that was actually really awesome. A lot easier than trying to do it in the snow. So um, there's actually only four of us sleeping here. And uh, it's actually kind of nice. So these are the tents that they have set up for us. Welcome to our crib. Let's see what it looks like. Oh wow, this is nice. No. Pillows and blankets. Damn. Not to, and water. water. Thank God, because I got to take some melatonin. Morning guys, it's about 7.15 and uh, a few things I learned last night. It gets really fucking cold in the desert. Um, you can sleep 
anywhere if you have melatonin and a sleep mask. And these blankets smell like pee. So here's the desert in the morning. <sighs> There's our house. Here's our breakfast setup. It smells like it smells like hot dogs. Um, and, and there's hot dog dogs. <laughs> it is hot dogs. I told you. I could smell them. <laughs> no, I could just smell them. I was like, are these hot dogs? And I saw the hot dog buns. And I was like, <gasps> oh, <laughs> that's interesting. Desert wieners. <laughs> <laughs> Dinner served. I don't know why. They have all these cans and bottles out. Maybe they're gonna be recycled or something. But it doesn't look very pretty. So overall, I think this trip was really awesome. I don't think I would recommend sleeping here, but I would recommend uh, doing the hour long camel ride and uh, staying for dinner and, uh, and dune bashing. It, it was fun. Um, I, but I think there's a reason that not very many people slept here. <laughs> but it was an experience and I don't know. There's a lot of tour companies that do it. We did it through North Tours, but you could really do it through any of them. I think I think all the experiences are pretty much the same. Probably around the same price too. So I'll put a link in the description to the one we used. Um, yeah, and you can decide for yourself.